Excuse me. Hi, I'm your neighbor Denise. I live in Unit 27. I was just coming to check on you to make sure you're all right. No. I don't want to pry into your business, but can I ask you what's wrong? Well, I, I turned 18 today, and my dad told me that I'm no longer his responsibility, and he kicked me out. You don't have any other family or friends you can stay with? No. Maybe I could help. How? Have you ever worked before? No. I might be able to help you find some work. Really? Yeah. I'm sure my boss would be more than happy to help. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. No problem. What kind of job is it though? The man I live with will pay $500 to have sex with you. I, I can't do that. And freeze. Wait. Daddy, she's here. Well, well, well. Look what you brought me. A beautiful angel. Girl, you did real good today. Thank you. <laughs> well, let's look at you. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Sabrina. How about we cut the chit chat? Get down to business. All right. Oh, you had to take good care of you. Daddy tells me you a virgin? How do you know my dad? Oh, we good friends. Answer the question, though. I am. Wonderful. How about we get down to business? Seen one of these? Yeah. Good. Guess you never seen one this big. I'm sorry, I don't. Where are you going? I don't know. Well, stay here for the night then. You need money, don't you? Tell you what, I'll talk to your daddy. Get him to let you move back home. Really? Yeah, he'll do it too. But first, you gotta do something for me. I'll take good care of you. Oh, don't worry. Oh, yeah, see? Yeah, you'll be all right. in the red envelope. Goodbye, you sweet thing. Sabrina. Sabrina. 
So why'd you really kick me out? Because I could barely take care of myself, let alone take care of both of us. Now you can? <laughs>